Hey friends, welcome back to Bend. Today we're gonna do a full body class together and we're gonna use some hand weights because we're really gonna get into that upper body. So I'm gonna use two kilos for the workout, but I want you to use anything you're comfortable with under that. So whether that's two kilos or all the way to 0 0.5, just whatever you're comfortable with, that's what you're gonna use. You also need your yoga mat, so go and grab all your things and let's do it. All right, everyone, let's do our warm up. So come and stand in the middle of your mat. Take a big breath in, reach your palms up. Exhale, circle the hands down, tucking the chin to the chest. Roll your spine down to the bottom. And then once you get down there, just hang out here for a moment. Just have a little wiggle side to side. Nice. And then slowly restacking that spine one vertebra at a time, coming all the way back up to the top. Let's do that again. Nice big breath in. Really reach those palms, extend that spine, lift that chin. Exhale, hands down, tuck the chin, roll that spine down. Good. And then once you get down to the bottom, we're going to take a deep bend into that right leg, straightening out the left. Right hand comes to the floor, little twist up to the sky. Really try to open that chest, bring it back through center, other side. Nice, coming back to center, slowly rolling that spine up to the top. Good, a couple shoulder rolls here. That's it, a couple forward. Nice, and then just lifting and lowering those heels, rolling up through your calves and your ankles. Nice, and then just taking those legs a little bit wider, squat it down, reach and twist. Squat, reach and twist, just for five. Four, three, two, and last one. Good, and then just a couple of arm circles. Nice, and a few forward. Cool, okay, let's get into it. So you're gonna take those legs nice and wide. So turning those legs out into that external rotation. Gentle little tuck of that tail under. From here, we're gonna come down to a nice wide squat. We're gonna squeeze it all the way up. So right away, we're gonna come through those inner thighs, through those glutes. Nice, so here for five, four. So as you're sinking down here, really push those knees out, and really squeeze those inside thighs. For three, for two, that's it. And next one here, hold it down at the bottom, lift your left heel, lower it down, and then the right, left, so just alternating, lifting those heels here for five, four, hands can be wherever you want, three. I've just been doing this all the time. Last two, and last one, heels down, little baby pulse up and down for five, four, three, two, and one. Squeeze it all the way up, off we go again. Lower and lift, lower, lift. Five, four, three, high, two, and one, hold it down at the bottom, lift your right heel, left, right, and left, we hit five, again, four, three, try to lift that chest, four, two, and one, heel stay down, little baby pulse here, that's it, Ooh, feeling those inner thighs for five, four, three, two, and one, last round here, let's go, lower, and drop, lower and lift for five. The words just come out, four. You have to decide what they mean. Last three, really squeezing those glutes here as well as those inner thighs for two. And one, hold it down at the bottom, lift, drop, lift, drop for five, four. Can you sink a little lower? Three, that's it. For two. And one, little tiny pulses here to finish off for five. Four, we're holding in three. Two, one, hold this squat nice and low. Can you reach those arms up? Holding for 10, nine, eight, seven, push those knees out for six, five, four, three, two, and one. Ow. Why did I start off like that? Okay, grab a hold of your weights and we're gonna move a little bit more through the legs. I'm actually gonna stay facing you. So. Weights are just gonna rest down by your side to start. We're gonna take our right leg across, 
little curtsy, curtsy lunge, step it over, other side. So just alternating sides here. That's it, actually, I'm gonna face this way. I'm gonna step off my mat, it doesn't matter if you do too. Nice. So weights are just resting down by your sides. We're crossing that back leg over. That's it, so again, a bit more work for those legs, we love it. That's it. Nice. Now we're gonna hold that next one over to the side. Lift it up, lower down. Lift and lower. Five, squeeze your bum. Four, keep those hips nice and square. Three, two, and last one. Hold it down at the bottom. You're gonna lift those arms out to a T-shape. Lower back down. Lift and lower for five. So really think about squeezing your shoulder blades here. That's it. Three, nice and strong through those arms for two. And one, bring the weights down, little pulses up and down for five. Four, three, two, and one. Bring it to center, other side. We cross, we over, we cross, and over. That's it. Whew. Last two here. And meet me over to the other side. Lower down, lift it up, lower, and lift for five. Four. Remember squeezing those inside thighs for three, two, and one. Hold it down at the bottom. Lift those arms, drop, lift, and drop. When I say drop, I don't mean just let your arms drop down by your side. I mean slowly lower it back down. Last four, three. Squeeze your shoulder blades, two, and one. Bring those arms down, little pulses through those legs just for five, four, three, two, and one, bring it in. Alrighty, feet are gonna be hip distance apart. Weights are gonna press up to the shoulders. Lower down for your squat, press your palms up to the sky. Lower down and squat, so a little shoulder press here. Good, we're here for eight, seven, six, squeeze your bum all the way up to the top. Five, four, three, two, and one, bring it down halfway. Little pulses up and down through those arms for five. Four, keep that bum low. Three, two, hold this shape in one. Now from here, one lift to the sky. We lower, we open, we close, lift to the sky. Lower, open, close, lift for five. Keep that tummy on. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze your back for four. Nice, strong shoulders here. Three, two, and on this next one, you're gonna kick those elbows nice and wide. Little baby pulse here for five, four, three, two, and one. Bring the weights back to the shoulders, lower down, press it up. One more round, let's go lower and press. So moving through quite a dynamic class today. You're so welcome. Last three. Try to get nice and low here. Last two, and give me one more like that. Nice job, bring it halfway. Little pulses here. I say shoulders, but I mean boulders, right? <laughs> Last four, you're like, shut up, tell me what to do. <laughs> Last three, two, and one. We press to the sky, we lower down, we open, we close. Lift, lower, open, close. Last time here for six. I personally think this feels really good. Last four, staying low here. Last three, last two, that's it. And then on that last one, keep those elbows nice and wide. Little baby pulse here for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, my arms might fall off. Last three, two, and one. Bring those hands down, lower down, squeeze it up. Lower and drop, that's it. So again, just a little reset here through the legs. I am trying to make your arms fall off. So if they do, I think that's my job accomplished, really. Last three, last two, and on your next one, hold it down the bottom. You're gonna bring the weights up. You're gonna punch, punch, lift, drop. Punch, punch, lift, drop. If you wanna move a little faster here, go for it. That's it. So really twist it across, extend that shoulder out as you punch. Good, let's go for three. 
two. And on this next one, we're gonna stay low, just those punches here for five, four, three, two, and one. Bring those hands down, pulse through the legs for 10, nine, eight, seven, weight into those heels, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Little reset, off we go. Punch, punch, lift and drop. Punch, punch, lift and drop. Five. I'm kind of giving you this like awkward smile, like please don't hate me, just keep moving. <laughs> Last four. We have three, and then just those punches into and one. That's kind of what I imagine skiing to be like. Not that you're punching, but like you're moving like that. <laughs> Last three, two, and one. Bring those weights down, pulse it out for 10, nine, eight. We're gonna hold in seven, six. Open that chest, pull those shoulders down. Five, four, if you're panting like me, you're doing it right. <laughs> Last three, two, and one. Bring it to center. Okay, moving on from here. You're gonna bring one palm down in front of one thigh, it doesn't matter what side. And then the opposite side is gonna be facing that hip. Little soft bend in the knees, little L shape through the arms, bring it back to center, take it to the other side. So we are alternating sides here. So just working into the shoulder and the side of your body. Again, I think this feels really good. So just take your time, really try to slow it down on the way in. That's it. A few more like this, come on. Keep those glutes on, keep that upper body nice and strong. I am right here with you. That's it. Alrighty, on this next one, just sticking to this one side. So just lowering, lifting, just to one side for five, four, three, two, and one, switch it over straight to the other side. Lift and drop again, just sticking with this same side, lift and drop for five. Bit of coordination here to have your arms doing two different things. <laughs> Last four, three, two, and one. One more round here, alternating sides. I kind of regret that. <laughs> Keep that tummy nice and tight. Good, really try to squeeze your, lat, your side of your body when that arm is out to the side coming down. Last two. And last one, bring it to the other side. Lift and drop just for five. Four, three, two, and last time there, take to the other side. Oh my goodness. Last five, four, three, come on. Weights down into, give me one more. Excellent work. Okay, just pop the weights to the top of the mat. Bring yourself back into the middle. Come down for a squat. You're gonna lift it up halfway, drop all the way down, just half and full, half and full, for five, four, three, two, and on this next one, we're gonna pulse it out. Good, palms can be prayer, they can be by your hips, you can reach them out to the back. We're here for six, no we're not, we're here for three, two, one, hold it down, lift that left heel, drop, right heel, then both, left, right, both. If that's too much to lift both, just keep alternating sides. Last three. Oop. Last two. And last one there. Come all the way up. Lower it down. All the way up. Squeeze your bum like your life depends on it. Lower it back down. We're here for five. Four. Three. Two. This is as hard as you make it. So I really want you to make it hard for yourself. And one, bring it halfway. We lift half, we drop full. Lift half and full for five, four, three. Come on, we're having fun, right? Two, and one, pulse it out for six, five, four, three, two, one. Hold it here, left, right, both. Left, right, both for six. Stay low. Five, four, both feet lifted. In three, in two, and one. Keep those heels lifted, little baby pulse. Oh my God, I'm shaking so much for 10. Nine, can you reach those arms out? Seven, 
six, sorry, not sorry, five, four, three, two, and one, squeeze it all the way up. Oh. Mean, 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 aren't I? <laughs> all right, down into that all fours. We just need one weight for the rest of the class, so we just move one out of the way. So just bringing one weight down to the floor. Let's just do a nice little tight cow to just mobilize that spine a little bit. We're gonna rock the head side to side. That's it. Get that breath back. Nice. And last one there. Good, I'm just gonna fix my ponytail because I'm not sure if I like it or not. All right, <laughs> enough about my hair, let's keep moving. So you're gonna grab that weight into your left hand. You're gonna ground down through that right side of your body. So knees are under hips, right wrist is under right shoulder. Now from here, we're gonna extend that weight up to the sky. You're gonna bring it down just in line with your knee. You obviously can't take it too far down, it'll hit the floor. So just lowering just to that knee, lifting up as high as you can. Try to keep your arms straight, shoulders nice and square. Good, we're here for five, four, back of the neck is nice and long for three, two, and one. Now from here, extend it back, bend your elbow, extend, lower down. We lift, bend, extend, lower, just for five. Four, keep those shoulders square, Three, that's it for two. And on this next one, just bend and extend that arm. I know, for five, four, three, squeeze your tricep, keep that elbow nice and high. Last two, and last one, keep it nice and long. Can you pulse it out here for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, pop that weight in front. Ooh, that was spicy. Okay, staying on that left side, you're gonna extend those left toes out nice and long. Square the hips and shoulders. You can come down to your forearms anytime that feels better for you. Alrighty, so extending through that left leg, you're gonna lift it up to the sky and you're not taking it any higher than your glute. I don't want you to arch your back like this. Keep that nice and neutral spine. So we just lift that leg up, lower it back down. Lift up and lower. If you start feeling that supporting hip, too much pressure, push up into that opposite side. Good, last three. Pointing those toes, last two. That's it, and last one, keep it lifted. Flex, point, flex, point, for five, four. Both glutes working, three, two, and one. Keep it pointed, little baby pulse up and down for five, four, Three, push that floor away, two, and one. From here, you're gonna tap that left leg over to that right side, bring it back. Tap over, bring it back. Try to keep the rest of the body as still as you can here for five, four, staying crossed in three, two, one. Keep it crossed, little baby pulse up and down for five. Keep that tummy on, four, three, two, and one, bring it back in. Little reset, same side. Lift and drop, lift and drop. For five, four, three, come on. Two, one, keep it long, flex, point. Flex, point. Five, four, keep those shoulders and hips square for three, two, one, keep it pointed, little baby pulse up and down for five, four, three, two, one. Let's tap it over, extend back. Tap it over, extend back for five, four, three. Oh, that hamstring. Two, one, keep it crossed, little pulses up and down for the last six, five, four, three, two, and one. Ooh, that hurt. <laughs> Ow. Okay, grab that weight again. Let's do it all to the opposite side. Okay, so grabbing onto that weight in the right hand, wrist under shoulder on that left side, knees are back under the hips. You're gonna grab that weight. Remember, we're just taking it in line with the knee and then in line with the hip. Lower it down, lift it up for five, 
Good, so think really nice long here, extending out from your shoulder all the way to that pinky finger. Four, try to slow it down on the way back in. For three, for two, good. And one, let's add that little tricep. So it's one nice long arm. We bend the elbow, we extend, we lower down. Lift it up, bend, extend, lower knee to knee. Good, we're here for five. Four, so this is gonna really challenge both sides of your body. So if you're struggling like I am, you're not alone. Last three. That's it, oh my God. Last two. And then on this last one here, we're just gonna stay with that bend and extend for five. Really squeeze your tricep. My right side is definitely weaker and I'm feeling it. Last four, three, sing stars. Two, and one, keep that arm nice and long. We're gonna pulse it out here to finish. Just a little pulse to finish off for five. Four, three, two, and one. Okay, let's do that right glute. So extend that right leg out nice and long, square those hips. A little soft bend in the elbow, point those right toes, lift that leg, drop it down. Lift and drop for five. Four, three, my arm is literally shaking. Zoom in, tell me if you can see my arm shaking. Last three, two, and one. Keep that leg long, flex, point, flex, point for five. Arms can go as wide as the mat here as well if that feels better. Four, three, two, one. Point the toes, little baby pulse up and down here for five. Four, three, Two, one, cross that right leg over, take it back. Cross it over so you can tap the floor, take it back for five. Four, really extend out from that glute. Three, two, I'm still here with you, come on. And one, keep it crossed, little baby pulse, up and down. Five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it to center, take a little reset, push that floor away. Extend that leg out. Come on, last time here. Last bit on those glutes. I think you promise. Last five, four, three, two, one. Keep it pointed. We flex. Point, flex. Five, four, three. Remember, push up into that right side if you're feeling that on that bottom hip. Two, one. Pulse it out. Last five here. Squeeze your bum. Come on, come on, come on. Four, three, two, and one. Cross it over, extend it back. Cross it over, extend it back for five, four, three. Come on, two, staying crossed in one. Little baby pulses here, up and down just for six, five, four, three, two, and one. Push back, take a little child's pose. Oh dearie me. <laughs> Take a few big breaths in here. Okay, push yourself back up. Let's keep moving. Okay, we still need our weight. So just place it in the center of the mat to start. We're gonna press up to a nice strong plank. So from here, we're gonna take that weight over to the left side, left hand back down, cross it over to the right. So just alternating, taking that weight side to side. If that feels a bit too much, just hold a plank. Good. So try to stay nice and strong through the rest of the body as you find that instability. Zip that lower belly in. Good. We're here for four, three, last two, and last one. Bring that weight out of the way and just hold it here for five, four, three, two, one. From here, tap those left toes out, bring it in, then the right. Left and right for five, four. Squeeze your oblique, squeeze your bum for three, for two, and one. Bring it to center, take that weight over to the right and left, right and left. Come on, last time here for five. Keep those abs nice and tight, four, 
You'll feel so good after this. Three, two, and one. Leave that weight out of the way. Just hold it here for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, squeeze that tummy, four, three, two, one. Tap those right toes in, left toes in. 10, nine, eight, push away from that floor. Seven, six, five, keep it together. Four, three, two, and one. Come down from there. I'm not sure if I was telling you guys to keep it together or me. <laughs> okay, keeping that weight, we're almost there. Okay, coming down to the ground. Open up those sits bones. We're gonna use that weight still. If the weight is too much at any time, just get rid of it, but I think you'll be fine with it. So keeping the weight where it is, tucking that tail under, slowly rolling it down to the floor. Walking those feet in, fixing your shorts. Maybe that's my tagline. Okay, so feet are flat to the floor. Palms are gonna rise up to the sky. Take an inhale breath in here. As we exhale, we roll up we slowly roll it back down. We roll it up. Let's lift that weight up to the sky as we lift. Good, we roll it down. Just don't bring the hands all the way over your head, just keep the palms in line with the shoulders. Lift and lower. Nice. So thinking about those abs here, slowing it down. Close your eyes if you need to. That's it. Let's do one more like this. Lift it all the way up. And then we're just gonna bring it back halfway from here. That weight is gonna dip over to that left side. Bring it back to center. Over to the left side, back to center. For five, four, slow it down. Three, two, one. Bring it to center over to that right side. Dip and in, dip and in. For five. Four, breathe, three, yes you can, two, last time to that right side, and one. We roll it back down. Just assess if you wanna keep that weight. Again, you can drop it if you want to. Lift it up to the sky, slowly lower it back down. Use that breath. We lift up, we squeeze, squeeze those abs. Good, let's go two more here. That's it. This next one will be our last one. Lift it up, find that C curve of your spine. So you tuck that tailbone under, roll that pubic bone up to the sky, C curve of the spine. Over to the left, center, left, center. For five, four, for three, for two. And last time there, bring it to center, over to that right side. I genuinely just can't talk when we're doing abs. <laughs> Last four, three, two, and last time there, bring it to center, last round here. Big deep breath in to prepare. As we exhale, lift it up. Good, try to really use those abs to slowly lower yourself back onto the mat. Last two, slow it down. And last one here, bring it to center, find that C curve. Let's start over to the right, in and out. Over to the right and in for five, four, three, two, one. Bring it to center, five. This is the part where my arms might fall off. Four, three, two, and one, hold that weight to center. Big deep breath in. We're gonna cross side to side to finish off here for 10. Nine, lighting those obliques up. Eight, seven, you want a bit more, lift those feet. Six, five, four, three, two, and one. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, last little bit here, you can pop that weight down. Say goodbye to them, they're all done. Okay, rolling down from here. Take a nice big breath in, just a normal little crunch. Lift and drop, lift 
and drop. So as you're crunching up, I don't want to see any daylight under your back. I want you to push everything into the mat. It's going to wriggle a little further down. Keep moving. Lift and drop. Lift and drop for five, four, three, two, and one. On this next one, hold that little crunch up to the top. Bring the left leg up, right leg up. Reach those right toes out, bring it in, left. Alternating sides here, keeping that tummy nice and flat for five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it back to centre, lower down. Big deep breath in here, crunch it up. So as you're lifting, I want you to push the back of the rib cage down, imprint everything into the mat. We're here for five, four, three, two, one. Lift it up, bring those legs up, extend it out, bring it in, out, in for 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Squeeze your tummy. This is as hard as you make it. Don't cheat yourself. Last five or I'll find you. Four, three, two, and one. Keep those legs long, extend them up, reach those palms up if you can. Little baby pulses here to finish. Psycho, I know, for 10, nine. Your hands can come behind the head if that feels better. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Bring it down. Let's stretch it out, shall we? Cross your right leg over your left, flex both of the feet, scoot those arms through, holding onto that right shin, flex the feet here, close your eyes. It's all done. Just like that, it's finished. You did a whole workout. Good, try to relax the face and relax the jaw. And then let's crossing over opposite side. Again, scoot those arms through if you want to. A few big breaths in here. Nice, and then just bringing the feet mat with distance and then just rocking those knees side to side, rolling over those glutes. Nice, and then you can just gently roll yourself up. So from here, we're gonna keep our left leg bent. Oh, actually, I'll face you. <laughs> we're gonna keep our left leg bent. Right leg is gonna extend out. Arms out to a T-shape. We're really, really nice and tall, and that's fine. Nice big up and over, side bend. Try to keep that chest open here, lift that gaze if you can. Good, bring it back to center. Other side. Again, arms out to that T-shape. Little reach and up and over. Nice, bring it back to centre. Pressing the legs, take a nice deep breath in here, extend that spine. Big deep breath in and then as you exhale, we're gonna round that spine. Good, big deep breath in, extend. Nice big exhale, we round. So we can really pull in those knees. Good, just do one more like this. And we round. Nice, and then we're gonna glue the soles of our feet together, knees fall out to the side. Taking a nice deep breath in here, holding onto the shins, ankles, feet, whatever you wanna hold onto. Nice deep breath in, and then just start to fold forward. Just coming down as low as you like. And you can always gently press your elbows into those knees to deepen that stretch. Nice, slowly coming up from there, just crossing the legs, little head rock, side to side. Good, and then a little up and down. Nice, meet me in the centre. We're all done. Love it. That was fun. I found it quite fun working a little quicker through the arms, making a little bit more dynamic. Um, yeah, let me know if you enjoyed that. Thanks for working out with me again. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you soon. Bye.